Now, I wanted to continue next terminology, very interesting important terminology. Based on this uh, uh, four or five terminology, we have minimum one or two questions coming in interview room. So, please try to catch, okay. Written test point of view, technical round point of view, you are going to face some questions, okay. Please try to understand. Uh, now, tell me, already you know what is the difference between capacity and size. Uh, tell me, what is capacity? Capacity means, capacity means, um, total number of objects can store ok capacity is a number one number one into number capacity is a one into number that represents total number of objects can store in collection so total number of objects can store in a collection is represented by the word called word capacity huh, tell me I created our collection object, NIT collection I created, NIT collection call equal to new NIT collection. So, do you remember internal algorithm, it is creating array object with how many locations, 5 locations, na? this 5 is what I told you, capacity. So, capacity is the uh, total number of objects can be stored in collection. Then, what is next word size? Size is nothing but how many objects we stored in the collection is what size the objects we stored number of objects stored in stored past tense stored in collection is called what size for example how to store elements in the collection call dot add okay call dot add double quotes a call dot add of double quotes b how many times you call add method or insert method how many objects you stored inside collection how many objects you stored inside collection a and b stored then what is the size uh, this is called what size size is what now two so capacity is 5 size is 2 catch my point so capacity is the number of objects we can store and size is the number of objects we have stored fine now the very interesting important point default capacity or initial capacity what is the meaning of it uh, first capacity when you created a collection object first time with what capacity it is created that is called initial capacity whenever write a new nit collection with how much capacity the collection is a background created that is initial capacity so our default capacity so 5 is a capacity which capacity there are two capacities are there default or initial capacity and incremental capacity this 5 is what default capacity the first capacity with which the collection is created is what default or initial capacity nice incremental capacity meaning is what you know already okay incremental capacity is nothing but uh, the collection incremented capacity how much it is incremented to the next capacity so next capacity how much it should be incremented that number is what incremental capacity then now look at here um, i have added what collection dot add of double quotes c uh, next collection dot add of double quotes d uh, next collection dot add of double quotes e i hope you remember this code okay now here a b c d e stored the moment i return call dot add of double quotes e of remember algorithm the moment I write call dot add of f, then what happened? Collection capacity incremented a double, remember? Okay, now 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, right? Uh, now collection object, initial capacity 5 and then incremented by how much? That is called what? Incremental capacity. The next capacity, how much you are getting? That is called incremental capacity. So, this collection object incremental capacity is how much? double into 2 current capacity is 5 into 2 10 now current capacity 10 again incremented into 2 10 into 2 20 so this uh, into 2 is what called incremental capacity how much capacity must be increased uh, when size equal to capacity for storing new object that is nothing but what incremental capacity so repeating once again what is the difference between default capacity and incremental capacity default capacity is the initial capacity 
capacity with which the collection object created first that is called default capacity what is the incremental capacity the capacity by how much it has to grow the capacity by how much it has to grow is what incremental capacity the growing capacity we have chosen for energy collection is by double the double is incremental capacity is this clear then next another important word is there load factor load factor uh, load factor is nothing but the measurement load factor is nothing but the measurement that specifies load factor is the measurement that specify when the collection object should grow after how much collection is filled after how much collection is filled its capacity should grow to next capacity specifying by load factor by default maximum collection so uh, default uh, load factor is 100 percent but listen then i told you just now i told there are two types of collections collection type collection and map type collection collection type capital c collection type collections load factor is 100 percent that means uh, after filling the collection all the complete capacity when size reach it to capacity capacity is fine size also fine then now it is incrementing for storing uh, next element but you have something called map type collection uh, map type collection load factor is 75 percent that means after 75 percent elements are stored after 75 percent entries are stored then now you are storing the next element after 75 percent fill then map uh, map capacity will be grow to the next capacity that is what load factor so totally we have how many terminologies are there 14 terminologies in that last five terminologies what capacity size default capacity initial cap sorry default capacity or initial capacity incremental capacity and load factor please quickly repeat once what is a capacity total number of objects can be stored in a collection is called capacity size number of objects stored in collection is what uh, size uh, next what is the default in initial capacity the first capacity okay with which the initial capacity with which the collection is created is default capacity uh, what is the incremental capacity the capacity by how much it has to grow to the next capacity is what incremental capacity generally the incremental capacity will be uh, uh, will be double or half double or half means what for example current capacity is a 10 then next incremented by half 10 by 2 how much 5 total next new capacity is what 15 complete collection is built on the next capacity will be what either double or what half capacity they have designed and the next the load factor is the measurement by how much uh, the collection is filled after how much collection is filled its capacity should be grow that will be specified by load factor collection type collection load factor is 100 percent and whereas map type collection is what 75 percent okay so this is the story about uh, what uh, common terminology used in collection programming i hope you understand so i want to quickly revise all the 14 points and then we'll go for next concept okay first let me clean the board and i'll want to check your uh, what you call memory skills first terminology what is the first terminology element next one is what entry homogeneous object uh, heterogeneous object unique object duplicate object collection of collect collection of objects collection of collections mm, collection of maps and the next this side capacity size default capacity incremental capacity and last one is what load factor totally 14 terminologies are there these 14 terminologies please note down in your notes try to write all 14 terminologies and their uh, answers also you please try to write the meaning of all the words you please try to read and remember and with this terminology now we will continue next okay next videos are very very important so far we understand introduction to collection topic collection topic overview complete picture complete idea the thought i have created in your brain with this thought now we are entering into sun microsystem given collection classes collection api collection framework classes you are going to enjoy like anything in the next videos provided if you have got some idea in these uh, previous uh, or okay six or seven videos whatever i given so so please try to once again revise all these videos so subscribe to our channel to get more videos updates to you okay thank you i hope you enjoyed